guys, what is going on? It is Obadiah, and today we are back on the island, playing some Extinction Core. So, there is so much stuff that I want to do today. Um, I want to do a bunch of building. Um, we need to make, still need to make an industrial cooker. Right now, we're just running off the cooking pot, which is a little bit ridiculous, if I do say so myself. Uh, I want to make an industrial cooker. I want to make a chemistry bench. I want to make some safes instead of these stupid wooden boxes. I want to replace stuff with metal. I want to tame some stuff we need for kibble. I want to get an overraptor. There's just so much of this, like, little stuff that, like, is, is, each individual thing is pretty small, but there's so much of it right now. Um, oh, by the way, if you do enjoy the videos or if you learn something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And, of course, feel free to subscribe and share if you have not done so already. But, um, so I don't know exactly what it is I'm going to start with today. I also need to place a couple more beds down. Which right now I just have a few crappy sleeping beds and, like, then two regular beds. Um, oh, also, we added the fog remover to our mod list because fog was getting just out of hand. Um, I also want to see if we can do a little bit of breeding, maybe? I'm not quite sure. Um, so I did pick up a low-level alpha raptor the other day and uh, bred it out with somebody else's. And I want to see if that's ready to breed again them. This is the one that we got. Nothing super special. It was super low-level, 40-something or the other, and then it tamed out at 65. Um, and we need to make a, a saddle for it as well. Um, also, I want to make a wooden club and upgrade it to max and try to get some polymer. I don't know. There's just tons and tons of stuff I want to do. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, gather a bunch of stuff up. I think we need to go with some crystal for the greenhouse because I don't think we have a lot of crystal. Let's take a look actually really quick. Do we have... How much crystal do we have? Oh, we got a little bit of crystal, but we're going to need way more. So, I might fly the Anki up to the volcano, do a little bit of... Uh, a little bit of smelting, a little bit of uh, mining and crystal gathering, and then I will get everything ready, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys, so we gathered a bit of stuff up, and I think it's time to start putting stuff together, see what we can make. Let's grab our crystal. We have a, we got a little bit more crystal, maybe another 16 or 1700, but not a ton. Let's grab cementing paste. Let's grab polymer, all of our polymer. Oh, do you know what? We don't have any electronics. Ooh, we're probably gonna need some of that. And let's just start kind of throwing this stuff all together and let's see what we can make. Let's go with uh, structures. Crafting. Okay, we have a fabricator. How about uh, cooking? Beer barrel. Okay, have I learned the grill and stuff? I have. Why can I not make it here? Okay, well, let's take all. <laughs> and let's throw that back in there. Okay, all of it, sure. Do we make it all in here? Is that the problem? Okay, let's, let's take a look. Structures. Uh, 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 crafting. Grinder and chemistry bench we need. So for this, we need spark powder and tons more electronics, which we do not have. For this, we need metal and oil. Ugh, we are just failing it. Ah, for this, we need oil. Metal. Okay, so we're going to need to get some oil, it looks like. Um, we have a bunch more metal, and we just gathered more that we need to start smelting. How about for the forge? Let's start with that. Metal, crystal, cementing paste, oil, and polymer. Do we have any oil at all? Oh, we do. We have a bunch of oil. I didn't even realize that. That's a gamma up. Okay, so I think we can at least start with the... Let's take all. And throw it on here. So with Extinction Core, to make the industrial forge, you have to make it in the workbench. You can't make it in the fabricator like you normally do. So let's grab some more of this. Now let's make ourselves an industrial forge. F-O-R-G. Bam! Okay, so we got one thing make, made, being made, at least. Um, so I think what we need to set this up, I don't even know if there's going to be any room in here. I might have to make a whole separate structure for it, because they are massive. And I think there's not going to be any room. Um, I wonder if we could, could we stick it, like, back there? No? Okay, it's going to have to go in its own special fancy little area. So I'm thinking we're going to make either a little building just for it, or just stick it outside on some platforms, which is probably fine. Um, I mean, nobody should steal our stuff if we do just have it exposed. Anyways, I'll go ahead and figure that out, and I'm going to go get some pearls, and get some metal smelting, and uh, make some electronics, and I'll bring you guys back. Alright, so we have got pearls being made, or uh, electronics being made from pearls. Let's take all this stuff and throw it in here. Uh, we have all the oil we will ever need now. I just got like an extra seven or 8,000 oil uh, with my Anki. I, we might still need more pearls for stuff. 
Uh, but let's kind of see now what we need. So want to make the cooker, want to make the grill, and then we're going to be short on something for the grinder. Uh, what are we going to be short on? Crystal, maybe? No. Polymer. We're going to be short on polymer. Um, okay. So, but we got those two things make, being made. Oh, I want to go ahead and make a wooden club. Actually, I might already have one. Let's take a look. I do. I thought I had picked one up somewhere. Because I want to upgrade this sucker in the upgrade station and then use it to... Let's see, wooden fiber. To go kill some penguins. Uh, let's go with fiber. Let's grab 10,000. And then wood. We'll grab that many. All right, let's see if that should be enough to get us all the way up to an artifact. Attempt upgrade. Attempt upgrade. Sweet. And let's see how much polymer this will get us. Nice. That was easy enough. All right, so I'm going to fly back out to the snow biome again. Actually, let's get something that we can kill stuff, kill all this stuff with two. Um, do we have like a sword? I think I threw away all the swords I've been picking up because why wouldn't I do that? Um, tranquilizer pike? Sure. Let's try that. And we'll try to use that to get the penguins. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fly back over to the snow biome where all the penguins are and see if we can get some more polymer. All right, I've actually seen very few penguins around. These are the first that I've ran into. Let's go ahead and try this. Let's try with this sucker first. An adolescent. I think I'm just gonna try, oh, uh, killed it. I was gonna try to knock him out. There we go. That way I can, that, cause once you hit one, they all start to run away and I don't wanna like miss the rest of them because, go to, that's one strong little penguin. Uh, because I'm trying to harvest. So I'm gonna try to either knock him out or kill him. And then we'll come back. There we go. Awesome. Let's we'll start on this side and let's see what kind of stuff we get with this club. Uh, is this the one that we killed? There we go. What? We're still not getting anything? We're, that's still a super, super tiny amount. Oh, I was hoping we'd get an absolute ton. And that's definitely more than we maybe were getting. I think... But not by a lot. Ugh. All right, well, let's at least get us some polymer and we'll see if we can find any mantises. I mean, that's really where we get the most from. I don't know if, you can, if using the club on the mantises makes a big difference or not. How much polymer did we just get? 116? That's nothing. I've been getting more from mantises. Okay, well, I'm gonna look around, see if there's any more penguins. Oh, look, there's... Nope, those are tribes people. We'll stay away from those because we're just on our quetzal. But I'll fly around these other icebergs, try to kill some more penguins, get some more polymer. Ooh, there they are. Here's all the penguins. Heck yeah. And uh, then I'll gather what we can and get back to base. All right, we are just getting home from our penguin slaughter. We also stopped and grabbed a few pearls. I think we've got eight or 900 polymer. Let's see, how how's it doing in here? Open. Oh, a little bit of lags. There we go. Uh, let's transfer all. Okay, so we have the cooker now. We've got the grill. Oh, I just realized something that I did that was so stupid. I should have made the structures plus of both of these. These are useless to me. All right, so <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to do that. I think I'm gonna have to make the structures plus. I can't believe I didn't even, I didn't even think about that. Um, let's take all, okay, what's so heavy? This, maybe some of that. Oh, still can't move. Okay, let's start putting all this stuff, taking and putting it all over here in the structures plus crafting station where I should have been doing this all along. Um, now, I don't believe there is a Structures Plus Industrial Forge. Normally, wait, didn't I just drop stuff in there? Oh, that's the smithy. Uh, normally there is, but I think it doesn't work with the mod. That's why I had to make the regular one and just in the workshop bench or something like that. I'm not really sure. Um, I'm going to, let's see you now. Uh, da, 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 da. Is this everything transferred over? Metal, is that the only thing we're really missing? Okay, let's grab the metal. Uh, all right, now let's see if we do industrial. Yep, see, industrial grill. We can make 23 of them, holy crap. All right, let's make one. Let's make one cooker. And now, of course, we're gonna be short again on the other stuff. What are we short on? Oh, just metal? Oh, we got tons of metal. Where'd I put the rest of our metal? Um, I know we have tons more. 
where the heck did I put it? Ha! A stack of 5,000 right there. Okay, and now let's do industrial grinder. Okay, now, what else do we need? We need some fridges. Okay, let's turn gamma down so we can actually see our menus. There we go. So there is no fridge in here. So we got the cooker with grinder, the chemistry bench. Okay, what are we short on? Spark powder, that's no problem. Okay, let's turn gamma up just a tad. Spark powder, spark powder. Right there, 150. Now we can do chemistry bench. And I'll start getting these things placed. So this, these ones, I just kind of want to... Because these are the regular ones, right? Yeah, we're just going to place those and then demolish them. Because now we have the S-plus ones. Yeah. And demolish. Get, our, get, get some materials back. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, see what else we're missing that we need to make. Maybe get some things placed and bring you guys back. All right, guys. So we have got everything placed. We've got the chemistry bench. We have got the industrial cooker where I'm cooking an absolute ton of meat. We have got the grinder, we have the industrial cooker, we've got fridges, we've got vaults, we've got a whole deal set up. Uh, is that it? Did we set anything else up here? No, I don't think so. Uh, okay, so now I've just finished building all the stuff we need for our greenhouse. So eventually I do want to replace the whole base in like metal and glass and whatnot, and I figure we'll start with the greenhouse. Um, and I just realized I made a huge mistake. Well, dang it. <laughs> okay, so I made a bunch of glass floors. Um, I realized that these are actually ceilings, and if they are glass, you'll be able to see through to all my wires and stuff below, which I actually do not want. Ugh, do I have, hopefully I have enough. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna no, need to get more metal, aren't I? Look, I made 16 glass foundations. How useless. Uh, um, how about ceiling? Ooh, I hate when Gamma, like, wrecks the way you're menus look okay ceiling 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 metal ceiling do we have enough for 16 oh we have enough for 42 okay let's, let's do that one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen forty fifteen sixteen and those are gonna craft up um but we still do have 16 glass ceilings that are actually for that the actual ceiling so i also got a metal gateway glass gate gardener crop plots foundation nope not foundations walls that's, the, that's what we're missing. So we're going to go ahead and place these. So the deal with the structures plus stuff is not only um, does it cool and is it stronger, but it also works if you look at, yeah, S plus ceiling gives greenhouse effect. So that way we can do it without making the actual greenhouse stuff, which then, uh, see, it makes it a little stronger. Okay, so let's replace. So I'm not going to worry about windows because they're all see-through, so we don't really need windows. Oh, did I break one? There we go. So I'm going to go ahead and replace all of this stuff, get some crop plots laid down, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, so we have got this whole thing built up. Everything is glass or metal glass. Um, the doors I have set to automatically close. We have got the gardener set up. He will gather all the berries and crops and stuff for us. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to do two of each crop. So two long grass, two rock carrot, two citronol, and two uh, savaroot, and then four narco berries right in the middle so we can just always have an excessive, excessive supply of narco berries. Um, so let's go ahead and grab our seeds. We should have an insane amount of seeds. I've just been throwing them in this trough. Let's see. Seed. Oh, we sure do. So let's go citronol, savaroot, long grass, rock carrot, narco berry. The rest of the stuff we don't really need at all. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should do a little bit of medjo bear. I and mean, we got tons of medjo bears in here. Now nah, we don't need medjos. We'll always gather way more medjos than we'll ever need, just naturally. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw a couple seeds. Oh, but also we're gonna need some fertile. Oh, open. Fertilizer, which we should have a gazillion fertilizer, give or take. You know, give or take a few. In here. So let's go fert and take all. Bam. And we should have some more in here because there's an excessive amount of fertilizer. And take all. Perfect. That way, hopefully, we'll have enough to fill each of these things absolutely to the brim. But I don't know if we will. There's still a bunch more in there, but 30. Let's see. 30 times 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 
Eight, six, 12, 30 times 12, 300. Yeah, we should have more than enough to fill every single one to the brim, which will be awesome. And then we just gotta run some irrigation. All right, guys, we have got all of our pipes made. And now I'm thinking we need to start running some irrigation. So we'll start right here with the, uh, connecting it directly to the industrial hooker. And I'm wondering, let's see, if we go underneath, let's check this out. Because I would like to have all the pipes run under here. Do, do, do. Okay, so let's say I do this. This? Ah, oh, see, I don't want it to run all the way into the ground, though. Ooh, what to do, what to do. I think it might just be the only option. So what if we do that? And then if we run any other pipes, we're not going to be able to see them, are we? Okay, let's pick it up. Let's throw it out the other direction. Uh, we're gonna have to use a, our Quetzal, I think, to get these things placed. Because we gotta place it all the way down the cliff. Let's see what that looks like. I still don't think that's necessarily the ideal situation. But that's also not too bad. I would rather they run through the middle of this foundation somehow. But I don't think that's really possible. Or if it is, I don't know how. Ooh, so I guess we're just gonna have to run them. I guess we'd run it like so. Okay, let's go back inside and see what that looks like. That still, I don't think will be ideal, but that might be slightly better. Wait, where is it? Oh, is it in the ground? Let's see. Huh. Oh yeah, it looks like it is in the ground. I don't know, is that better? Is that worse? <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to see it if it's in there, is it? All right, so we're gonna have to run off the incline, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and get the stuff figured out, get the pipe laid, and then I'll bring y'all back. All right, guys, so we have laying our pipe all the way down here and straight down into the water best we could, using the angled ones to keep it along the edge, and then of course this way as well so we could run irrigation for our crops, which should now all be growing. Yeah, oh, we got some already. Ooh, oh, 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 we're freaking out. Um, yep, everything looks like it's seedling, seedling. Perfect, all have greenhouse effect, awesome. Um, so we've got this running here. We also put a couple taps inside of our building here so we can have actually have access to water. Um, ooh, that's not what we want. Drink some water, perfect. Um, so we have kind of everything else set up. We've definitely got a bunch of advancements made. I already grabbed the meat out of here, right? Yeah. So I put a bunch more meat and spark powder and everything in these so we can keep some more jerky going, move that jerky over to the fridge. So we got a lot done and soon we should be able to make all of our own kibbles. Um, except for, you know, of course, what we've been getting from the tribesmen people. Um, Anyways, we got a lot done today, guys. So for today, I do think that is going to be it. If you guys did uh, enjoy the video or if you learned something, do me a favor and uh, hit that thumbs up button. And of course, if you haven't yet, feel free to subscribe and share. You can also hit me up on all your social medias, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Facebook, even your Google+. And check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash Obadiah X. Anyways, guys, for today, that is going to be it. I really do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with me. Until next time, I will. See you later.